hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Been a little while since I've made some parts, but I had some issues to take care of. But anyway, let's just get right to uh, the level here. Uh, and it appears to be a puffer fish of death. Yes, the porky puffer is back. And it is angry for whatever reason. I didn't do anything to it, but it's gonna try and kill me in this toad collecting ball fest, whatever you want to call it, mini game. And that's all you have to do to beat that one, I guess. Not that hard whatsoever. Just to avoid the puffer fish, it pops out of the water. It's kind of like boss bass in that way. Uh, but at the same time it's not because it's not an instant kill. Like, you could run right through them if you wanted to. Anyway, let's go to 4-2. Here we go! By the way, in case you didn't realize, those are loading screens. Yeah! Again, more disguised loading screens of death. Um, you know what? I'm gonna keep my penguin suit here. And by the way, yeah, there's flopping fish of death as well. They're flying all over the place, they're trying to kill me, and I'm trying to hit that box, which would be kind of nice if I could. <laughs> oh, poopers. It would definitely be easier if I was small Mario, or if I could get a triple jump going on here. Because I would like to... Just a coin? All that for a coin? Come on, that was not worth it. What's in here? Oh, I should have hit that from the other side, shouldn't I? Uh, what's in the cloud? Me. Just some coins. Okay, what's what does the, what does the peace switch do? I, I want to clear the way. Oh, the donut blocks come back. I forgot about that. Ow! Oh, just some blue coins. I really don't care all that much. Come on, Mario, get. Come on. It's it's kind of hard to judge your jump when getting when getting out of the water because you it's ah fish in the face. Oh, it doesn't matter anyway. Um, it's kind of hard to jump out of the water because you never know because of all those like little wavy lines and stuff like that from the water. It's really hard to judge when you should be holding the button down as opposed to just tapping it. So you sometimes end up jumping a lot lower than what you expect to do. Anyway, let's try to speed and run this sucker! Yeah! And let's ignore that piece of there. Woo! That was fun! Oh, not so much fun. Fish in the face, not a party favor. And that was the first coin, as you could see. Kill the fish of death before they kill you! What's in here? Some coins? Okay. Uh, these ledges here, if you jump on them, you'll fall down. I should say you'll hang off them, but if you just walk across them, you'll, well, walk across them like that. You can also jump off them or drop off them. Wait, is there anything down here? No, I guess not, because I can't drop off them like I thought. I really thought you could drop off those things. I might be thinking of something else. Ooh, a star! Gimme! Let me get up here. What, what am I? What am I aiming for coins for anyway? I don't need coins. Uh, I've been playing too many Mario hacks lately. And uh, when when you have a really hard Mario hack, you start to kind of hope for more lives. So you don't have to like to life grind or something like that. You know, grind for lives, stuff like that. It's uh, ah shoot. <laughs> I was wondering if that fish was going to hit me, but yeah, it did. And these platforms fall, by the way. And I'm looking for something. I forgot where the last coin was in this, in this one. I remember it was something pretty tricky. I, I, I could have swore there was like a hidden wall or something that kind of messed with me when I did this before. Fish attack! <laughs> and no, 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 no! No, that, he, he just barely brushed me, and I, luckily I didn't take a hit. Must be because his fins are a lot softer, but I could have swore there was something... Like, I'm, I'm looking for the last coin. I remember it being really hard in this one. It's probably not hard at all, and I'm just making a mountain out of a molehill like I usually do when it comes to uh, coin locations. Ugh, give me a power-up. Oh, it's right down there! Dang it, maybe I was thinking of some other level. Well, this one's not hard at all. Just fall down here. Climb up, boop, and avoid the fish of death, cheap cheeps. They are very dangerous to your health, and there's the goal. Yay! I tip my hat to you as well, Mario. So, 
let's go to the next level. I'm just gonna go all the way straight across the next one rather than go to the... Oh, I can't go right across. I'll have to take the long way around here. Do, 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 do. And there we go, 4-3. Let's go! Loading screen. Oh, just breaks up the action. And there's crabs of death throwing rocks all over the place. Well, okay, they're just throwing them in straight lines. Yeah, so they aren't really all that dangerous. Just jump on them like that. Yeah, and we got giant urchins! And I gotta say, they are ultra cute. I don't know why I think they're cute, because they got... Well, I guess... Yeah, yeah, I, yeah I would say they're cute. It's kind of... like It's like they got this dopey face, and they're so huge. Normally, normally when you see a big enemy, you expect them to look ornery or something like that. Nope, not in this case. It's got a very cute face. Kind of reminds me of, like, a... Uh, uh, well, I was gonna say Snorlax in the way of its personality. You know how big Snorlaxes are within their dopey? You get the idea. <laughs> um, I am not gonna swim after those coins. That is... Why did I do that? <laughs> that is not worth it whatsoever. I will check what's inside these boxes. Because I have a feeling there's something good inside them. Is there one up there? Like, I need that. <laughs> so why did I even jump after that? I don't know. By the way, I'm at 92 lives in case you didn't notice that. And I'm, quite, I'm kind of a pickle now. Um, yeah, oh, mini mushroom. Actually, I could use that for getting this coin here. That's probably what the antenna means to do. Yeah! Yeah! Because I can rock, run on the water. I can walk on the water like Jesus. <laughs> and no, 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 no. Uh, I accidentally jumped. I, I missed the block and uh, bounced off the side. Wait, 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 wait. I want to check what's in these pipes, don't I? Because I bet you there's something in these tiny pipes for Mini Mario here. Eh. No, 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 let me... I, is there any some... I wasted a mushroom for that? Oh, I, I see where I'm supposed to go into. You go down here? And the, the urchin shouldn't hurt me if I run across. There we go. Into the pipe we go. And there's a bunch of urchins. And they're just there. They aren't hurting you whatsoever. They're just there for show. Just to watch you as you swim by, I guess. And that was the last coin. Please don't die, Mario. Don't die. Wait. What's... Nah, that's not worth it. That's not worth it at all. <laughs> Look where those coins are positioned. Uh, I was gonna do the red coin thing for a power-up, but it's just like, eh, no. No, just no. So, let's just get to the goal here. And I don't believe there's a secret exit in this one. Uh, careful. Okay, I can just do something like this. Let's do... Oh, I got the one up. Chipmunk Mario for the win! Look at him scamper. <laughs> and I think I could be, yeah, I think I have time to do the fortress here. There's two exits in the fortress. Why did I press left twice there? I don't know. <laughs> but let's get the fortress started. I definitely prefer not to be Mini Mario here. But I'm pretty sure there is a secret here for Mini Mario if you have it. And uh, there's blocks on conveyor belts, as you can see there. Uh, if you're underneath them, they'll squish you and kill you instantly, but that should be pretty obvious if you've played any Mario game ever. Uh, then again, uh, some Mario games you don't die instantly when you get squished, so I guess I shouldn't say that. Uh, what's in here? Nothing? No? Okay. Well, let's see what's up here. I don't think I missed anything in that first room, so I'm just gonna go on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa! Yeah! I wanted that coin badly. I seen it, I aimed for it, I got it. And just gonna just gonna feel around the walls. I don't think there's anything in these walls. I just wanna make sure, you know, just so I don't miss anything. And I bet you there's some boxes coming. No, there's not. Hmm. I just swore there was. Well, oh, there's a bunch of coins up here. I don't need those, that's for sure. Uh whoa, 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 whoa. Let me up there. Wait, wait, something in here? This certainly seems like that I would hold something. Yeah, there's an ice flower. Is that something that I want? I don't know, but I gotta be careful with my ice ball so I don't accidentally... Oh, I see a secret! Uh, I, I was gonna say accidentally uh, free something I don't want to. That was coin number two. There's a checkpoint coming up right there. And... Oh, some propeller blocks there. That'll come in handy for sure. Boop. And... Red coins? Yeah. 
And let's see what prize I get for collecting all of them. Gotta catch them all. That, that's gonna go on the upper floor, isn't it? Whoops! Uh, I don't think I can jump down there to get that without dying, because the screen doesn't scroll back down. Or maybe it does. I, I didn't really pay much attention. But some of them, some of them the screen doesn't scroll back down, so I don't think that's really, <laughs> you know, worth reading the block for, especially since I, since I can't take it through pipes anyway. And I gotta find the right place to get through here. I guess that'll do. That will do. What's in here? Let me hit box! Box hit! Please! <laughs> a coin! Again, that was not worth it! Jesus! Give me better prizes, man! <laughs> wait, wait. Is there something hidden in that wall? That wall green wall over there? Something tells me there might be. No? No? Okay. Let's just wait for a box to climb up on top of so I can jump and then jump! There we go. Um, wait, 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 I see a secret. You can't fool me, Cindy. Eh. Wait, what? I thought there was a secret here. Along this wall, somewhere... I thought... Oh, you do need to be Tiny Mario to get inside that little... Do you see that little alcove over there? Yeah, there was a secret up there. Or I should say there is one. See that? Come on, screen scroll, get away from the coins there. Um, there we go. See that little opening there? Yeah, you can take a tiny Mario or mini Mario into there and get through there. Uh, there I don't think there is anything in there, but, but coins or one-ups or something like that, but not worth it. Okay, but there is a big secret in this room that you're going to want to go into. Okay, wait for those first four crates to... Oh, shoot. Well, I'll be back in here anyway. Uh, but you see that darker green wall over there? Yeah, wait, 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 oh, wait! Well, that sucked. <laughs> but you see that darker green wall down there? Yeah, that's a pipe that leads to the secret exit. So, we gotta go back in here anyway, and I'm not very far away from that spot, so... Well, I'll cut ahead. Okay, we're back into this room, so... Let's just try and do this with a tad more success! Okay, secret exit. I'll definitely grab that first, uh, just because it's definitely a lot harder than the normal exit, so let's get up here. There it is. You don't even have to fight a boss for this. It'll just take you right over to the cannon, you know, the cannon to warp you to later levels. But as I said before, this is a 100% run, so I'm not going to be doing that. And, wait, did she... She just gave up and moved to the castle? I didn't even defeat her! What the heck was that? What the... Okay, I'm gonna go face her normally. Oh, there's a toad. I'm gonna completely ignore that. Okay, we're back to this room. This time, I'm gonna be playing it safe. I'm gonna climb up these boxes layer by layer until I can get to that coin there. And then, there we go. Now I can climb all the way up to the top safely. And as you can see, this is the boss area. I see a secret, a bunch of coins, a fire flower, and that's it. So that's that, and now let's go face Wendy. Not the fast food restaurant. Ooh, spooky. Uh, I could actually just throw fireballs at her if I wanted to. Oh, and I'd also like to mention about the uh, screen scroll thing. Yeah, it does scroll back down if you should ever fall back down or just want to jump down uh, at whatever time. Just I would mention that. Uh, that's all. <laughs> As you can see, she's just got jumps. She skips and jumps away, and she shoots these bouncing rings. They look kind of like the donuts from Metroid or something. Uh, normally you'd have to jump on her to hit her, like something like that. Uh, but I was just using the fireball method just because I could. And that's really all there is to it. They bounce at 45 degree angles in straight lines, so it's a very predictable boss fight. Okay, now she's officially been defeated, and now she can go crying over to that castle. You know, the actual castle, not fortress. <laughs> So I think that's about all the time I'll have in this part, just to keep the parts at a good time, you know, length. Don't want to make them too long or anything like that. So I'll end it off here. I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in the next part.